analysis that you are doing. We did all of that analysis in the oil industry and the darkness that was still in the land. All our projections never came to pass. All our interpolations never came to pass. Because of the darkness that was in the land. It was obvious that God had made us a wealthy nation. But the world could not be seen. God never intended that anyone in that land would be a poor man. But the poverty is, is, is palpable. It is because of the darkness. So when we got this and we saw that you can break from a season of darkness as an individual into light with more stature and more capacity and we now discover that you can do that territorially that we can decide that London Satan will back from London yes we can decide if you keep if you keep sowing the seed of prayer you will begin to see the day star the morning will begin to down Oh, some things that were possible before in the land will no longer be possible because the priests of light had come into the temple. I came, I came to charge you up. We are in the season of a watchman. We are in the season of the watchman. Yes, you are eating. You eat chicken, eat chicken. No. Wake up. Wake up. It's time for us to migrate. Great things are determined by heaven, but it will take watchmen to download them. I've seen the power of prayer. If the power of prayer is in its consistency. Stay consistent. Even it may not make sense. Just keep the routine. Keep it going. Keep it going. Keep striking. Keep striking. Keep striking. Keep striking. And things will break. I saw the darkness of my city break. I left supernatural ships 2020. Went back home, the first thing that happened to me was the pressure to leave my job. I left. I obeyed God. And then I noticed that the anointing increased because I obeyed. Okay. Ah, then I preached. Eighty sermons after I left here. Those empty sermons, oh my. Was an announcement. Are you with me? And from that time, so many people across the world began to listen to me. I said, yeah. okay. In the city where I am, in the state where I am, the economy of the state is such that you cannot capture the things that God began to do. God took us beyond the economy of the location. Such that when the governor came to our building, we gave him the microphone, he said, huh? He forgot himself. He, he didn't know the world was watching him. Huh? That... So this thing happened in my territory and my money is not even in it. And that was good. It was good he made that statement because people thought it was a government funded project. Uh, he said my money is not in it. I was so happy. I said glory to God. <laughs> Do you know that so <laughs> You can make impossible things happen in your territory. Tonight, God is going to come. See, a rain will come upon you. Yes, there is a rain that is going to come upon you because many things are going to shift. See, if you open your heart tonight, oh my, the energy that it takes to be consistent in the place of prayer until you see a change will come upon your life in the name of Jesus. We are the ones that can change the tempo, change the situation, change the circumstance. Satan is not in control. He's not in control. He's not in control. He tried to kill me, but I'm still here. <laughs> I'm, still, I'm still here. And I'm more determined than, than I used to be. This encounter with me resolved the issue of determination. If you are still here, I'd like us to take a moment in prayer. It's in the prayer we are praying is that God will do something to you, to do something to me in the next five minutes that will increase your capacity, that will set you on course, on a definite course of migration. A definite course. Oh! On a definite course. He wanted to run out of prison naked. 
The angel say, hold it. Put on your sandals. They say, hold it. Guard yourself. Throw your robe over your arm. It's, it's, it's a red carpet reception. It's not a rescue strategy. The angelic activities that are soon to be activated around your life. Oh my God. Oh my God. Simon Colemite. Facito Braske for Mante Guria. There are the things that are opening up. There are dimensions that God is unleashing on your life. You are going through a migration by the Spirit of God. There is transport. There is transport. There is transport. There is transport that is taking place. I could be there's a migration taking place God is moving you as I speak there is a movement there is a movement the tsunami of shift is coming to take over in the affairs of your life what might happen might look like a dislocation but it is so that you can be relocated and brought into the full context of your destiny I see the hand of God straight forth already it's straight forth already oh 